The Development History of the Fabric Dyeing Tradition from Ancient Times to Modern Times The art of dyeing fabric has been practiced for thousands of years across many cultures and civilizations, from ancient Egypt to medieval Europe and beyond. The history of traditional dyeing techniques is a rich and fascinating one, reflecting the cultural, social, and technological changes that have shaped human societies throughout history. One of the earliest known examples of fabric dyeing comes from ancient Egypt, where textiles were dyed using natural materials such as indigo and matta root. These dyes were often used to create intricate patterns and designs, with some textiles featuring images of gods and pharaohs. In ancient Rome, dyeing became a highly specialized craft, with different colors and shades produced using a range of different natural materials. The most prized dye was Tyrian purple, made from the secretions of a type of sea snail, which was reserved for use by the Roman elite. During the Middle Ages, the production of dyed fabrics became an important industry in many parts of Europe, particularly in Italy and France. The most famous dyeing center was in the city of Florence, where a guild of dyers was established in the 13th century. These dyers used a range of natural dyes, including matter, woad, and indigo, to create a range of colors and patterns. In the 19th century, the development of synthetic dyes revolutionized the textile industry, allowing for a wider range of colors and shades to be produced more easily and affordably. The first synthetic dye was created in 1856 by William Perkin, a British chemist, and soon after, other synthetic dyes were developed by chemists in Germany and other countries. Today, traditional dyeing techniques are still practiced in many parts of the world, particularly in rural areas where natural dyes are often used to create unique and vibrant fabrics. In addition, there is a growing interest in natural and sustainable dyeing methods, as consumers become more aware of the environmental and health impacts of synthetic dyes. Overall, the history of traditional dyeing techniques reflects the ingenuity, creativity, and cultural richness of human societies throughout history. From ancient Egypt to modern-day textile artisans, the art of dyeing fabric continues to inspire and fascinate us with its beauty, complexity, and endless possibilities. Dyeing textiles has been an important craft for thousands of years, allowing humans to color fabrics for clothing, decoration, and religious purposes. The earliest evidence of dyed textiles dates back to the Neolithic period using natural dyes extracted from plants, insects, and minerals. Over time, dyeing techniques evolved and became more complex as trade expanded and chemical knowledge grew. In ancient civilizations like Egypt, Greece and Rome, dye stuffs including indigo, matter root and cochineal were traded internationally and used to color linen, wool and silk fabrics. Colors held symbolic meanings, with purple representing royalty and scarlet representing godhood. Religious orders used specific colors to indicate rank and status. Dyers formed guilds to protect trade secrets and ensure quality. During this time, mordanting, a chemical process to fix dyes to fabrics, was discovered, allowing for more stable and longer-lasting colors. In the Middle Ages, dye stuffs such as logwood, brazilwood and well became available, allowing a wider range of earth tones and yellows. Textiles became imbued with social meaning, with sumptuary laws regulating who could wear which colors. The cultivation of dye stuff plants expanded and dye shops operated mainly for local customers. Islamic dyeing methods developing vibrant reds, blues and greens influenced European dyeing. 
The scientific revolution led to great advances in the knowledge of chemistry and natural dyestuffs. Fermentation methods were discovered to produce new colors like violets from orca lichens.